Washington, Republicans pressed the U.S. Justice Department on Wednesday to name a new independent prosecutor to probe alleged bias in the FBI after a top agent's anti-Trump text messages were released to the media. With special counsel Robert Mueller's Russia investigation increasingly threatening President Donald Trump's inner circle, Republican legislators said the private messages between the agent and a department lawyer, both formerly part of the Mueller team, undermine his investigation's credibility. They also cited fresh evidence of bias of others in the Justice Department and on Mueller's team, including links to Trump's former Democratic rival, Hillary Clinton, as signs that his probe cannot be carried out fairly. DOJ's reputation as an impartial arbiter of justice has been called into question. Bob Goodlatte, chairman of the House Judiciary Committee, told Deputy Attorney General Rod Rosenstein, We are now beginning to better understand the magnitude of this insider bias on Mr. Mueller's team. The comments came a day after Trump's lawyer, Jay Sekui, also called for an outside investigation into bias, in a move aimed at putting the Mueller team on the defensive. The best course of action in our view as lawyers was that a special counsel be appointed, to look into all of this, Sekulo told Fox News. Speaking to a hearing of the House Judiciary Committee, Rosenstein acknowledged the individual issues but stressed they had been correctly addressed, and rejected claims that Mueller's probe is politically tainted. I'm not aware of any impropriety, he said. We have employees with political opinions and our responsibility is to make sure those opinions don't influence their actions, he said. But Rosenstein took heavy flack after the release of text messages between FBI agent Peter Strzok and FBI lawyer Lisa Page, who were both dropped from the Russia investigation in July, reportedly after Mueller became aware of their extramarital affair. The hundreds of messages, mostly sent during the presidential campaign last year, showed Strzok calling Trump an idiot and a douche while Page said of Trump, this man cannot be president. The messages called into question not just the Russia collusion probe before and after Mueller took it over. They have also sparked calls for the Justice Department to revisit the FBI's decision last year to exonerate Clinton over her use of a private server to handle classified official materials while she was Secretary of State. Strzok had been a senior investigator on that, and reportedly had a role in the decision by former FBI Director James Comey not to prosecute Clinton. Republican lawmakers and Sekulow also cited the pro-democratic bias of most of the members of Mueller's team, as shown by their campaign donations. And they also pointed to the newly disclosed role of a senior Justice Department official and his wife in the notorious Russia dossier, a file compiled by a former British spy detailing links between the Trump campaign and Moscow. The official, former Associate Deputy Attorney General Bruce Orr, was reassigned after it was shown that his wife helped compile the dossier, which was paid for by the Clinton campaign.